Hi, I'm Lavina Matamidi. I'm a line dance instructor and choreographer in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. And I'm here today with Regina Chun, uh, who is a line dance instructor as well and choreographer. She teaches in Richmond Hill. Right. Hi, Regina. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Hi, everyone. Uh, so I, Regina, I've been doing interviews uh, with uh, choreographers abroad, overseas, but also uh, I'd like to start showing the faces of our instructors here mm -hmm. in Ontario. So um, I, I'm sure everyone would love to know a little bit more about your background, how you got into line dancing. Actually, I started line dancing ten, about 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. And then before then, I danced as well. But once I got married, and I had my babies, and then I stopped for a moment. And then, until 10 years ago, I thought, maybe I need some exercise to do the stretching. And then once I went to the first lesson, I fell in love in line dance already. And that's how I started. And then after two years later, I started to teach and uh, choreograph. Wow. <laughs> so you've been line dancing and choreographing pretty, right. pretty early on. Yeah. So it seems like you're really passionate about yes. music and, yeah. and dance. Yeah, and other than line dancing, I also, like, I'm also a ballroom dancer and I compete in ballroom Latin. Oh, yeah. Wow. Have you found that studying other styles of dance, such as ballroom, has helped you with line dancing and Oh, definitely, definitely. Because like all kind of dancing, line dancing, there's so many dances. This different cut type, and that is waltz, tango, cha-cha, jive, everything. So if you explore in other area, they will for sure benefit your dancing technique. Mm -hmm. And uh, you were telling me that now you have another new interest, which is yes. line dance shoes. These kind of dance shoes, they are so pretty. And this is not only for line dance, it's, it's like a, for all kind of dance. And I look at the stones at the front, and also the heels. And uh, we have another type of heels. It is bigger and one and a half inches, and then very comfy. And Julie Harris, uh, she's wearing the, these kind of shoes the whole day at workshops. And recently, I've seen the video in Paris, France, and then I saw the half of the floors, people are wearing these kind of shoes, and I think they are getting popular. Wow. Well, you know, for the evening when we have the dance parties, if you're wearing a dress, for example, you want to have something that's prettier, a nice, pretty shoe. In the daytime, we like to wear sometimes the boots, but then at night, you might want to wear something oh, a little more glamorous, and this definitely is glamorous. Yes. Yeah, and yeah. also we have more than 25 colors. So if you are interested, you can contact me via Facebook, my website, or email. Yes, we'll post uh, some links yes. of how to contact yes. you. Yes. I think that line dance is just beautiful and uh, it's great to see the community of line dancers in Ontario expand and just we love sharing our passion right. for line dancing. Yes. Thank you so much, Regina. Oh, you're welcome. Wonderful. Thanks for having me.